Okay, still with me, this is now part 8 of our second day Dialax Evo training. Okay, so I hope you now place all, all your luminaires properly in your building. And for this one, it's very easy because it's just a straight line. So if you go back to our original Dialax file, you can just make it like draw line arrangement. And make it like this. And add the fittings maybe into 30 pieces. Yeah. And then place it upward to your building. So for the straight line, it's easy. But for the curved line, you have to be very patient on how to place it properly. So it's like that. So it will be look like that. And now if you want to add a color on your luminaires, we need to put a filter for every fitting. So it will become blue like this. Yeah. So how to do that? So let's go back to our sample project. So how to do that is to select the luminaire and then go to this tab, filter, and then select the filter that you want. For example, you can select from the catalog and then filter catalog and then you can select it here now. So for example, you like green or maybe blue. So just uh, press the color, let's say green, and then apply. Press the apply and make sure it's here now. And then when it's there, say uh, click and apply this one. So once you applied it, you will now have the green color here. So for example, let's render it and let's see how it will be look like. So we cannot see the green color right now because it's too far from the edge of the building. And, but see now this is having a filter color. So if we go and move it a little closer to the building, select it all, and then move it closer to the building, go to the plan view. So we will see the effect of the green, then move it closer. And then let's continue rendering and see if the effect of the green is there in the building. Okay, so it's there. It's looking good. So that's how you put a filter. So if you like the green or blue, it depends on you. So you can play and use this filter tab and select your own color. So that's it. I think it's done. So let's go and summarize everything. First, build the road and put a texture and then create a contour for the landscaping and then select the trees from 3D warehouse using Pecan Planner or SketchUp and then create the ramp using uh, object and then cut the floor using the cut tab also the water bodies using the cut tab and then what else you can create your building also using the object extrusion of, uh, volume and you can just mirror it to the other side so it will become low poly and then you can insert now your luminaire using the curve reference line so it will be very easy and then of course um, yeah you can aim and place all the other luminaires um, accordingly based on the layout or based on what you want to highlight then if you want to add ob um, 3D objects from SketchUp, maybe for example this one, I think this is one. This is from 3D Warehouse, so you can just import it either using Picon Planner or SketchUp. And make sure you watch the videos, the video tutorials from my YouTube, chan YouTube channel to complete this uh, project. And so that's it. And if you have questions, send me an email and I will come back to you and answer all your questions. Alright, that's it.